8.1 question number one. It's given that in a right angle triangle ABC, segment AB is equal to 24 centimeter, segment BC is equal to 7 centimeter. We need to determine sin A, cos A. Sin C, cos C. This is a right angle triangle. Pehle to right angle triangle banate. Now, oh, no. sin A ke liye na mujhe hypotenuse chahiye hota hai, sin theta ki. That is opposite upon hypotenuse. Jo in my introduction video mein maine bataya tha. And cos theta is again adjacent upon hypotenuse. But the sin theta find out karu ya cos theta find out karu, mujhe hypotenuse chahiye chahiye chahiye. Hypotenuse ka matlab 90 degree ke opposite wala is called hypotenuse. Now, mere ko ek side diya hua hai, dusra can I find out? Yes, kaise? By Pythagoras theorem. Now, in triangle a, B, C measure angle A, B, C is equal to 90 degree yes, can I both sit down A, C square is equal to A, B square plus B, C square so what do I get? A, B square it's 24 square plus 7 square B, C square 24 square is nothing but 576 plus 49 what do I get? 625. Now AC square is equal to 625. Now AC ka square chahiye ya AC chahiye? Mujhe AC chahiye. So taking square roots on both the sides. So mujhe kya milega? Okay. Or pyaar karna chahiye ya. Pyaar matka P ka power or ye kya root. So P upon R that is 2 upon 2 is nothing but 1. So cut se cut. So mujhe kya milega? AC is equal to 625 ka square root is nothing but 25. So I got the value of AC as 25. Now solving sin A. So sin A or cos A ki baray maat karte hai. Likta hume haan. Sin A. What is sin of angle A? It's nothing but opposite side of angle A upon hypotenuse. Okay. So kya hai opposite side of angle A? It's nothing but BC upon hypotenuse AC. BC is how much? It's 7 upon 25 AC. Okay. Now what is cos C? Cos A sorry. It's adjacent side of angle A upon hypotenuse. So in introduction video mein aapko bataya tha. Ya aapko yaad hona chahi. Aap S for sign, S for start. Bachcha pehda hota hai to start kaha se kata? Opposite se. Sign is always opposite side of angle A upon hypotenuse and cos is always adjacent side of angle A upon hypotenuse. Adjacent side of angle A is nothing but your AB. A ko do adjacent hai. Ek AC hai, ek AB hai. But mein kaun sa loka? AB ko. Kyunki AC is a hypotenuse. So it will be AB upon BC that is nothing but 24 upon 25. So my sign A is 7 upon 25, my cos A is 24 upon 25. Now let's talk about sin C. So now talking about the sign, yeah, it is confirmed. Sin C, but the opposite side of angle A upon hypotenuse. So opposite side of angle C, sorry, my mistake, it's C. Angle C kya hai? It's AB. So AB upon AC, that is 24 upon 25. Now what is cos C? It's adjacent side of angle C upon hypotenuse. Matlab, देखो यहां से C से दो एडजेसेंट है एक AC है एक BC है किसको लूंगा BC को क्योंकि AC इज द हाइपोटेनस सो आई विल टेक BC अपॉन AC दैट इज नथिंग बट BC की वैल्यू क्या है 7 AC की वैल्यू क्या है 25 सो दिस इज माय वैल्यू साइन ए अपोजिट साइड ऑफ एंगल ए अपॉन हाइपोटेनस BC अपॉन AC 7 अपॉन 25 cos a adjacent side of angle a upon hypotenuse a b upon b c that is nothing but 24 upon 25 sin c opposite side of angle c upon hypotenuse that is equals to a b upon a c equals to 24 upon 25 cos c adjacent side of angle c upon hypotenuse that is nothing but b c upon a c equals to 7 upon 25 now let me show you the representation in a box okay so a b is over 24 b c is over 7 we need to find sin a cos a sin c cos c AC. So we know that by Pythagoras theorem for triangle ABC, 
AC square is equal to AB square plus BC square, 24 plus square plus 7 plus square by substituting the values of AC uh, of AB and BC, we get 576 plus 49 that is nothing but 625 centimeter square. On taking square root, we got AC is equal to 25. Hence, substituting the value as given below. If you like it, do share, subscribe. Thank you.